So we have just left Morrow Bay and we're heading north up inland a bit to a town called Fresno but we're just doing a stop over there to buy more warm clothes because we are going to Yosemite National Park today. So we're driving down the highway, we just left a small town heading up to Fresno in Yosemite and we're being pulled over by a police officer. 20 miles an hour over. Yeah, I don't, I don't know, I don't. So we are in Walmart, which everyone knows what Walmart is, and basically there's a whole cabinet of guns. They're cheap too. And yeah, they're not even that expensive. Like $128 for this one. Um, a handgun. 50 bucks. We can't even buy like cigarettes or alcohol in our general stores and they're selling guns. This is crazy. Like, they're not even expensive. $30. 30 bucks. So we have arrived on the outskirts of Yosemite National Park and we're just climbing up the range now. The Yosemite Valley Bridge. Uh, uh, the East Fork. Uh, I don't know if I'm actually going to get a little house up there. Just in the middle of nowhere. Yeah, there actually is a little uh, house. Shit. It was great. So we've just stopped at a little espresso coffee shop to get some coffee and some drinks and find some directions actually. We're heading up to Yosemite Valley Lodge, which is where we're staying. But um, we actually have no service on our phones. We had to put it in the GPS and stuff. So yeah, we're gonna head up the mountain now. It's getting colder and colder and getting pretty excited. It's really beautiful around here. The trees and the snow on top of the mountain. So it's exciting to see. And there's Matt. And yeah. Is that snow? Yeah. It's guys, it is snowing. It is snowing in Yosemite mountains and this is very exciting. Wow. You'd almost call it sleep. I don't know if you can see it in the camera. I'll go back up. Okay, we got snow literally pelting at us and it's coming in through the roof. The snow roof. This is very exciting and... Wow. I think we got here at right the right time. the side of the road and it is snowing full on snowing I don't know if you can actually see it but we all uh, it's like it's snowing guys Beautiful. typical Aussie I'm wearing thongs what do you do but my hands are going so red it's so cold and I think it's only gonna get colder from here what do you think of the snow Oh. Yeah. What do you think of the snow? Okay. Okay, so I think I can automatically put Yosemite onto one of the most beautiful places I've ever seen. I've got my slides on in the snow. So that's a bit stupid. But this is just amazing. We've got a waterfall up there. I'm pretty sure it might be Yosemite Falls. It's Jamie and Rachel. It's very cold, it's zero degrees. And I'm about to cross this muddy lake in my socks and thong today. I'm gonna keep the video on because if I slip, it's gonna be worth it, isn't it? Okay, thanks for the help, guys. Thank you. Thanks, guys. I got it. Okay, we have all this beautiful snow happening, but Matt has actually lost his wallet, so we are literally walking through this snow looking for his wallet because we don't know where it is. It's not in the car, and that's a serious problem, so... <sighs> so we've just made it into Yosemite, and we have just checked into our room. It's a very big, spacious cabin. So that's nice, very warm in here, very cold out there. So along the way up here, we stopped over to um, play in the snow and all that, and Matt lost his wallet. As he lost his wallet, it started snowing. And then when it started snowing, the sun started going down. So it was the worst timing possible. So all four of us were out in the snow looking for his wallet for over an hour. We drove around to spots that we had previously been in and couldn't find it anywhere. And then get back in the car and Rachel goes, Hey Matt, is that your wallet? 
and his wallet was in the car the whole time. So, having dinner, this is a burger I got. It's like all loaded up. That's the lid's got to go on there. And Matt got like, that's the uh, medium soup, and it is like it's massive. Wait, we put the sauce on ourselves, do we? Yeah. So it's our first morning here in Yosemite. We didn't get any more snow overnight, and none is predicted for the time we're here. But this is the remainder of the snow from yesterday. It is currently negative two degrees Celsius. And we are hiking today up to the Yosemite Mountain Waterfall, which is the largest waterfall in North America. And it's like a six hour round trip. So that's gonna be fun, woohoo! Dylan's already been complaining for six hours about it. So we're halfway there. So we're hiking up Yosemite Mountain, the waterfall. It is a round trip of 11 kilometers. It's bloody freezing, but I'm also really hot because I have too many layers on, so I started sweating on the inside, but cold on the outside. <sighs> this place is lucky it looks good. So we've been walking for about 10 minutes now, so we've got quite a walk ahead of us. Very slippery and icy. This is just absolutely, this is just absolutely incredible. And we're still not even halfway, like, like it's the largest waterfall in North America. So I imagine we've got a fair bit of climbing to go. There's no signs even telling us, but it's beautiful. So like, it's a fair trade off. The higher and higher you go, the more and more beautiful this place gets. It's getting a bit steeper now and we're dawdling a bit because we keep stopping to take photos but we're well underway we've been walking for over an hour now up the mountain it's getting quite warm even though it's only like three degrees now when you're hiking in these conditions you warm up i've had to take my beanie off my gloves off and unzip my jacket How you go, Matt? Pretty good. We've just found the waterfall. I don't know if you can hear it in the camera, but it just... It's just cracking and crashing. It sounds like gunshots or breaking ice. So it's actually warming up a little bit now. The sun's blaring down on us. It's only about three or four degrees. But the sun's quite warm, and as we're wearing our warm layers and clothes, you really start to feel it. Matt almost slipped. Okay, so we've got 0.2 of a mile left, which is about 300 meters-ish. We're almost at the top. And I'm glad we are, because I'm bloody over it. You see the little animal prints here? So, I don't know what they are. What do you reckon they are, Matt? Um, something that enjoys the cold. This is the overlook. We are actually at the top of the falls now. We're not really going much higher. There's so much snow up here. Uh, there's more people. We haven't seen civilization in three hours. Uh, very icy. Uh, I think we finally made it. Okay, so for some stupid reason, I've decided to get to the top of Yosemite Falls. And... Oh! take a photo I think it's like zero degrees up here they're gonna have warnings about this down in the camp next week I reckon okay we made it to the top of Yosemite Falls the tallest waterfall in North America I just took a sneaky pick I'm bloody freezing Woo! but um this view I'm pretty sure was worth it I don't know how to get there how'd you get there this way I'll go this way. The snow is very deep. Um, uh, oof. And this is what we were rewarded with for hiking for two and a half hours. Welcome to the top of the world. Smile! Oh wow, 
So we're on our way down, but Matt's gone somewhere else because he wants to keep looking. But it's going to take us three hours to get down and my socks are wet. My feet and my toes are absolutely freezing. This place is bloody beautiful, but I've had enough. I just want to go back to the heater. I'm freezing cold. When I took my clothes off earlier, my shirt actually was put in a puddle of water. So I have no shirt on the top. So. so walking down is using a lot less energy. It's a lot easier on the legs and stuff, but a lot more slippery and hard. So we're going a bit more slower than I'd like. Kind of just want to, you know, be home already. Ah, it's beautiful though. It's just all the um, snow's turned into ice now and melting, and it's really slippery. So, we've really got to be careful. We're still on our descent down the mountain. We've just got back to the waterfall. Almost a two hour walk to this point, actually. And we've got an absolutely stunning rainbow. So we're about five minutes from being from the bottom of the Yosemite mountain waterfall. And we just did a, what is it? Six hours, 13.27 kilometer round trip up to the top, to the highest waterfall in North America. And I can honestly say that is probably the hardest thing I've ever done. It was so steep and then the snow was up there, it made it freezing cold and all the water over the rocks had turned to ice. So it was extremely slippery and quite dangerous. So we're back at the bottom now. Um, we're just gonna head back in, probably go sit around the fire cause it's a bit chilly, have a good drink. <laughs> and um, yeah, so that's been our first full day in Yosemite, hiking the Yosemite Falls trail. Not everything is easy in life, okay? Some things are hard, some things are harder than others, and some things are really, really, really hard. And if you just quit every time something becomes a little bit hard, then you're never going to achieve anything, okay? Today you achieved a lot. You climbed up the largest waterfall in America. You wouldn't have done it unless you were pushed, and you feel good now you've done it, don't you? Yes, Matt. You've achieved it, okay? Yes, and it wasn't Matt. easy. It wasn't, it, was, it wasn't easy. In fact, it was fucking hard. Life Lessons 101 hard. with Matt. Apparently this was a whole learning experience. Okay, so we're back on the very, very ground. We're staying just over there. It doesn't really look great in the photo, but we climbed all the way to that, to the very, very point up there. So we are ice skating in the Yosemite National Park. There's Rachel up there in the red. I mean, if I fall over, at least I'll get it on video. That'll be good. That's Matt enjoying the fire. <laughs> On our way out from Yosemite, we have just come to a place called Tunnel View and it looks right down the Yosemite Valley. Okay, we are going into the tunnel. So this is the way is the out of Yosemite view. and that's really cool. There's a man. I don't know what he is doing, but we're going through the tunnel to get out of the Yosemite Valley and then back onto the freeway heading over to Santa Cruz, and then we're off to San Francisco. And we have exited the tunnel!